Hey there, Vicky. Hey, Maya. Whoa. Did you get a lip ring? Oh, this old thing? Well, getting it didn't hurt as much as you think. All you'll need is a trusty stapler, like this one here. Don't worry, she's not going to staple her lip. Use the end of a stapler or a stapler remover to snag a staple you find lying around. Now, find something round that you can press the metal on to smooth out its shape. Ah, there we go. Okay, Vicky, what do you want to pierce today? You know, I've always wondered what I look like with a nose ring. See? You can just stick the staple on top of your skin. No permanent holes required. Just gotta let my hair down and channel my inner bad girl. I love this thing. All right, girls, start posing. Oh, wow. Look at that natural beauty. Ugh, her too. What do these girls all have in common? Gorgeous freckles! Okay, let's see here. Do I have any hidden freckles in there? Nope, not a one. Wait a second. I think I may have a solution. Yep. Maybe I can do something with this henna I have left over from that birthday party I went to last week. Start by placing little dots on your cheeks. Keep going and add as many as your heart desires. And don't worry if they're not all the perfect shape. Real freckles aren't all the same either. Clearly, Amy wants to have a lot of freckles this time. All right, that ought to do it. And boom! A freckly goddess has arrived, ladies and gentlemen. Those look pretty real, don't they? This place has the most amazing dumplings. You've got to order some. Ooh, I forgot we ordered sodas. Yummy! Oh, waiter! They forgot to take the cap off. Oh well, I can probably figure it out. This thing won't budge! Ugh, even the old table trick isn't working. Yeah, I don't think that's working. Ugh, I really don't know what to do. That's it. I'm gonna bite it off. Amy! No! What are you trying to do? Pop a tooth out? Gimme that. I'm about to save you a lot of aggravation. Ready? Hold a chopstick in the same hand as the bottle and swiftly slam them down at the same time. Boom! See? Your drink, madam. Bon appétit, ladies. Oh, I'm so happy we decided to celebrate your birthday outside, Sophia. Vicky! Oh, hi! What are you waiting for? Get over here. Um, okay. If you've ever walked on grass with heels on, you definitely know this strup. I, I feel like I'm sinking into the grass. I knew I should've worn flats. Let's rewind things just for a second. If you don't want to sacrifice fashion for outdoor fun, try wrapping pieces of wax paper around the heels of your shoes. Once secured, place the heel on another sheet of wax paper. Put on globs of hot glue on the heel and around the base of it. After it's dry, remove the piece of paper and you've got yourself a little heel protector. Watch out, grass! This fashionista is coming your way! So next time you're out picnicking with your friends, make sure to keep a pair of these in your pocket. Pop those suckers on your heels and walk to your heart's content. See? No sinkage here. And by the way, that outfit is fabulous, Vic. Yay! Happy birthday, Sophia! Aw, oh, that's so cute. A group hug. Ah, <sighs> finally. A night off with absolutely nothing to do. Shoot, I totally forgot about my date. Oh man, my hair's still wet. Oh god, come on hair, behave! Oh man, I'm all out of soda. Oh, I have the best idea! Thank you. This cup is about to save the day. Have wet hair? Try out this hairdo hack. With a cup to your head, take strands of hair and twist them one by one around the cup like this. Don't forget the bobby pins. Pin your hair down so it stays put. Keep going. Finally! 
finally, you got all your hair up there. Don't forget to pin that last piece. Last but not least, whip out your hair dryer and get blowing. All dry, time to take the cup out. Watch as Amy's strands fall into perfect curls. Wow, since when did Amy turn into a hair model? Girl, you're officially date ready. Wow, how'd you get your hair to look like that? Oh, I just did a little trick. No biggie. Wow, Amy, you look stunning. Oh, I know. Shall we go to dinner? Whew, I just love movie night with the girls. And you brought out the good snacks? Nice! Vicky? Whoa! Since when did Vicky get tatted up? So, girls, like my new look? I'm guessing you didn't discuss your new tattoos with the girls yet? No offense, but you guys are way too gullible. Love tattoos but aren't sure you'll love them forever? Then why not make your own temporary ones? Cut out a print of a design you love. Don't worry about getting it right along the edges. Now spray the front of the print with perfume. Next, fill a small bowl with water. Place the print face up in the bowl. Now wait for about two minutes. It's time! Wherever you choose to place the tattoo, spray it with perfume. Place the print face down on that exact same spot. Spray the top of the paper just one more time. Make sure it's completely pressed against your skin. After a minute, go ahead and lift the paper, revealing your brand new tat. Pretty cool, right? Oh man, that really does look real! Sophia? Sophia? You okay? Hey, you passed out. Huh? What happened? We all got tattoos! You did too, see? <gasps> what?! Please tell me this isn't permanent! Don't sweat it, Sophia. You can totally take that ugly thing off. A little micellar water will rub that guy right off. Really? Oh, thank goodness. See? It's all good. That was a close one. Taking a stroll on the beach was a great idea. But wearing a skirt? Not so much. Ooh, oh, no one saw those buns. Oh, and you may want to steer clear of any stairs. The wind will blow that sucker right up. Yikes. Really gives the saying sun's out, buns out a whole new meaning, doesn't it? Oh, thank goodness, a bench. Phew, that was my bad. If you ever find yourself in a compromising position like Olivia here, search in your bag to see if you have any band-aids and coins. Okay, here's how you can use these items to keep your skirt weighted down. Flip the bottom of your skirt up and place the coin on the underside that's facing up. Now make it stick with a band-aid. Keep twisting the skirt around, taping coins just above the seam as you go. Alright, let's give this bad boy a test run, shall we? Okay, so far so good. Not today, wind. I've come prepared, see? This walk across the beach should be a lot easier now. Strut your stuff. Okay, just one more mile and we'll be beachside. Calling out sick from work was the best idea ever. Well, this spot looks perfect, right by the water. Okay, so sand and ocean mean one thing. Bathing suits. Now where's mine? Uh-oh. Looks like I only brought the bottoms. Now what am I gonna do? This definitely isn't a nude beach. Don't sweat it, Olivia. Those bottoms may be more versatile than you think. Take your bottoms like the ones Olivia has here and turn them upside down. Go ahead and pull the strings all the way out of the waist of your shorts. Next, go ahead and pull that string through the crotch of the bikini bottoms. Wrap the string around your neck so that the crotch of the bottoms is touching the base of your neck. Instead of tying the string in a knot, cross them and pull the ends to your sides. 
pull the strings through the leg holes and back out again. Lastly, tie the strings in a knot behind your back. There! Well, look at that! A brand new bikini top! And a cute one at that. Alright, Vicky, I'm ready for some fun under the sun, baby! Wow, this looks like a legit bathing suit ad. You'd never know Olivia was wearing bikini bottoms on her top. Whoa, careful there! 